Also, there's two other devices here that I noticed, and this is called the Folk Radiation Belt Electrons. What I found interesting was this red blotch here that um, just like whips around the earth. Look at that. Whoa. And it, and it keeps like circling. And I, I don't know, but I think that might be our satellite band right there. Those, that line. And it looks like this is coming inside the satellite band. See that thing? It's like, it's going around and around the earth. This one is showing the same thing, just in a different color. See it right there? It shows up in yellow on this particular device. Okay, just wanted to make a quick note of that. Moving on. Okay, you guys, this is showing the magnetopause position, and yes, this is definitely our satellite band right here, because those are satellites that you see moving around. So, as I was saying earlier, there is the red that's coming inside of our satellite band. And look at the pressure to the left. Wow, look at all that. Whoa, it just released it. And then it starts building again. And what's the square shape happening back there? Wow, look at it, it, like, expand right there. And then we've got red behind the earth. The field lines are looking all squiggly. Look at that. Wow, what is going on right there? Yeah, I would, I, you know, I'm no expert at this because I'm just learning, but there's something very scary and ominous about what I'm seeing here. You know, it just gives me a not a good feeling. That looks very uh, troubling. Okay, moving on. Okay, you guys, I wanted to add this in with the uh, video I did earlier. And um, all these arrows that you see here are all supposed to be flowing back. The sun is over here to the right. And this is the earth. You've got the sun facing side, the back side. All these arrows that you see are pointing this way. Should not be pointing that way. All these should be going straight back. And watch as they move around. And look at the pressure that's building behind the earth. Look at that. Huge amount of pressure right there. It builds. And look at the arrows pushing up from behind the earth. Look at that pressure. Whoa, there it goes. It's bleeding out tons of pressure right there. And now we've got some pressure building on the front side. Whoa! Do you see that? Man, that was like, it 
totally squish the whole magnetosphere down and let's look at that again. Wow. And like the arrows lose their staff and they're just a chevron. I'm not sure why that would be. So let's move this forward. Wow, look at that. That's exactly what I was showing you on um, this device. And now you can see it. It's happening. It's coming through on this, this device also. And this is called Bat, Bats Rust Z Cut Solar Wind Velocity. Look at, what is that? Do you see these straight lines of color that come in? Somebody could explain that to me. Whoa, and then it just squeezes everything. Check out all the arrows just go, whoop. Wow, okay, that's tripping me out. Went. <laughs> Excuse me. And it's like a repeating pattern. The pressure builds up. It bleeds out the pressure. It's almost like a pulsing. And I guess the red is the radiation. I'm not sure on that. Wow, look at that big ball of pressure goes shooting out the back. See, and then it starts build. Oh, it starts building behind the earth again. <laughs> Excuse me. Wow, whoa, that was huge. Let's pull that one back and look at that again. Wow, look at that. And, and look at the arrows. They're just going <laughs> all kind of directions. But as you can see, it's like blowing out from the earth. Boom. You seeing that? Okay, guys, moving on. Hey, you guys, how you doing? Got you over here at the Iswa Magnetosphere. Why don't you guys kind of take a look at this because that is out of this world insanity right here, this black. I just want to show you what it's doing for today. Today's date, 11-1-2018. Let me go back to the first little loop. And look at all the energy. Okay, that's kind of like it's supposed to look. Uh, we're definitely not supposed to have all this thick red pressure in the front. Our radiation hitting. There's lines breaking loose. And I want to point out this diamond here in the center. And then there's this little guy, this little insignia. You'll see those moving around behind the planet. And those are satellites. We have the GOES-14 and the GOES-13 moving around behind in this little area right here. Okay. So. Look at how the Earth is throwing out these waves of energy repeatedly. Oh, and look at all the lines broken, shredded all over the place. And I'm not sure why we have this front line here in the front. I'm going to have to go watch uh, Blue Kool-Aid's video. 
and I want to give a shout out to Blue Kool-Aid. Oh yeah, because if it wasn't for him, I wouldn't know how to work these instruments. He's a great teacher. Thank you, Blue Kool-Aid. Oh yeah, you guys need to go and check out his channel. He's awesome. But watch as this starts to flow through right here. Look at that. And I'm, I'm pulling it back and forth so you guys can see that. Wow. Okay, so we get one of these what is that? The Eye of Ra? <laughs> that is crazy looking. Boom. It throws that out. Let's go. Kind of straightens out a little bit. Throws out another one right there. I mean, these are huge bursts of energy coming out of our planet. Either at something or it's throwing it out. Yeah, weird. Off the charts craziness. Whoa, did you see that? Look at how the red, the red lines around the edge are going to like squish in this whole area and then boom, roll back. Watch. See that? Squishes the field lines down and literally ripples down the back. Wow. What in the heck is causing that? And all the strangeness coming out of the back, like it's trying to wrap around a planet, ship or something. Whoa. Is that like the black hole? The wormhole? What is that? Wow. Check that out. I mean, like, wham. So after the planet gets squeezed, or all those fill lines get squeezed in, it builds up this charge, if that's what it is, I'm just guessing, and wham, throws it out. Wow. Ooh, and look at those front lines. What? Oh. Trying to get it to stop on that. What in the heck is that in there? Why, why are there lines? Let's see, that's an IMF line, the purple, out in front of our planet. Shh. Alert, alert, alert. Something is very wrong. Wow, look at those lines move around in the front. Wow, what's that? What is this? What is that in the front right there? So this has been going on uh, all day with our planet. She's having, is it birth pains? What is going on? Is she being charged? Is she waking up? There's so many crazy theories. Look at this long, I guess it says closed. I'm not sure what that means. It says closed polar cap IMF field lines. Okay, so the black is the field lines. The blue is the IMF. Polar cap is the black. And then it's closed. I'm not sure, you guys. I'll have to do some more study on that. The main thing is I want to show you all this stuff that's going on with our magnetosphere that should not be happening. Like that. Wow. It's just kicking out energy. One big leap after the other. Wow. Just blowing it out right there. Look. There it goes. 
so yeah that's that's for today I'm just backing it up so you can kind of take a look at this you're welcome to pause it and go back through all this wow that one right there is spooky looking Yeah, and I think I'll just end it with that. And um, you guys, please have patience with me as I learn um, exactly what all these different signatures are mean and 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 exactly. I mean, because even Blue Kool Aid says he doesn't even know what is causing this. He he suspects it's a planet pushing up behind the Earth. And that's why all of this is wrapping around it. And I'm right there with him. I'm thinking, yeah, with all the crazy stuff we're catching on the cams, that there's something back there and the, the earth is reacting to it. And if I suspect that these planets that are around the sun and coming toward the earth they've been coming in for a while and they've been draining the energy from the sun so maybe that's why they have the artificial sun simulator if that's even real I don't know I'm just guessing but see those little things moving around right there those are the satellites the diamond and the little spider looking thing right there so, all right, you guys, thanks for watching. I hope you have a great day. Raven out.